तृणमूल कांग्रेस ऑन फ्राइडे एज हिटा उठैर एक्टर एंड भारतीय जनता पार्टी एमपी परेश रावल कॉमेंट ऑन बेंगोली वाली वॉज कैंपेनिंग फॉर द बीजेपी इन गुजरात आफ्टर इज कॉमेंट्स एंड वायरल ऑन सोशल मीडिया इशूड अ क्लैरिफिकेशन एंड सर दैट ही डिड नॉट मीन टू हर्ट एनी वन फीलिंग ऑफकोर्स द फिश इज नॉट द इशू एज गुजराती इज डू कुक एनी फिश बट लेट मी क्लैरिफाई बाई बेंगोली आई मैंट इलीगल बांग्लादेशी इन रोहिंग्या बट स्टिल इफ आई हर्ट योर फीलिंग्स एंड सेंटिमेंट्स I do apologize is what he tweeted Are you tumare no bhai gas no batlo mongo chhe to sasto thai jase Mongwali upar gayi se to niche aavse rozgar ban loko ne marse pad a badu marse par tumari aaju baaju jar Bangladesh ne rohingya leta to Delhi ni jam tar tum shu karto A gas no batlo mata to shu pehla bangali ni fish pakao to shu karto tum रावल former mp during his campaign in the state of gujarat now the tmc is up in arms against parish rawal in fact in mahua moitra has also said that uh, the slapstick man need not have apologized the second part of cook fish like bengalis is have brains like bengalis is what she said taking a dick at parish rawal surya agni is getting us more details on that story surya agni in fact when he did say bengalis in gujarat it did appear that he was referring to all bengalis including the ones in india however this was a divisive statement meant to target bangladeshis and rohingyas well you know if you just look at the tweet uh, in the, where you know he has apologized uh, over his particular comment that has drawn more flack wherein uh, you know he is writing parish rawal is writing that by bangladesh by Bengali he meant uh, illegal Bangla illegal immigrants uh, Bangladeshi illegal immigrants and growing that so that has drawn more flack uh, uh, on uh, you know on uh, Paresh Rawal now uh, the Shilomon has slammed him for that particular comment of his uh, a Bengali nationalist group named Bangla Pokko they have uh, you know uh, directly stated that they will not let uh, any film or product releases uh, of uh, Paresh Rawal happen over here in West Bengal uh, Uh, they have planned protests against him. So uh, this, you know, this has stirred up pretty big over here in West Bengal, and uh, uh, be it on the political side or other movement or other, you know, other bodies, uh, they are, uh, you know, completely taking it up, and they are up against uh, Paresh Rawal's comment. But you, all right, Surya Agni is getting us all of those details, and be with us, Surya Agni. I'm just coming back to you. The TMC has raised this issue, given that he spoke about. what you are going to do with gas cylinders cooked fish for the bengalis is what parish travel had said during the course of the election campaign referring to gas cylinders being expensive he also went on to say suryagni that the prices will come down essentially trying to hint to the fact that food prices and also prices of gas cylinders going up is not something that should be a poll issue isn't it well you know if you look at that particular video which went viral where uh, Uh, Parish Rawal was clearly heard stating in the chat that uh, uh, you know prices of LPG employment you know they will change uh, you know prices of gases will come down people will be employed but uh, uh, will the people over there be able to uh, reside with uh, illegal Bangla illegal Bangladeshi residents and uh, you know Rohingyas and that has uh, stirred up this entire controversy where uh, he was his father probably went on to state that. Uh, 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 will the people over there uh, cook? Uh, what will they do with the with, with, a, with, with a drop of LPG prices? Will they cook uh, food for Bengali? Will that you know clearly stirred up this entire controversy that we are speaking about? And as I mentioned, uh, you know, Sneha, uh, it hasn't been taken in a nice way over here in West Bengal. Uh, various uh, bodies, uh, various uh, 
bodies, be it political body like a Trinomul Congress has slammed him, a nationalist group which is not uh, politically associated with any party, uh, Bangla Pokho, they are slamming him. They have called for boycott of any product that is being advertised by Paresh Rawal. They have clearly stated that they will not let any release of Paresh Rawal happen over here in West Bengal. Uh, Planned protests, uh, you know, are there against Paresh Rawal today as well. Uh, so this... Degne, I'm just coming back to you in a moment from now. TMC Shogat Roy is now joining us. The actor Mr. Roy has now clarified. Paresh Rawal has said, this is not an issue as Gujarati is also cook and eat fish. But let me clarify, my Bengali meant illegal Bangladeshi and, and Rohingya is what he's saying in a clarification. How do you respond? Paresh, Paresh, Paresh Rawal is a foolish man. That's why BJP did not give him ticket this time. And what he said, critical of the Bengali, is highly condemnable to insult a race today. is the worst thing that can happen. So, good that he has withdrawn and he should not use such language for Bangladeshi people. You accept the apology? Being a Bengali yourself? Yes, yes, of course. Okay. All right, that was graceful. Sagat Rai, I'm thanking you for the moment. Paresh Rawal with his rather controversial statement there. And he is now clarified, saying that this was not in reference to Bengalis living in India. I was trying to talk about illegal people coming in, in the sense Rohingyas and also Bangladeshis, is what Paresh Rawal spoke about. The TMC says. Sagat Rai, senior leader of the TMC says that he's accepted this apology. However, he said that this was unwarranted. This was not done. TMC has hit out at the actor and BJP leader, former MP Paresh Rawal, for these statements during the course of an election campaign in Gujarat.